Hello. The question says the, the Venn diagram below shows the number of students in each of the three courses at the university, mathematics, chemistry, physics. Given that there were 25 students all together, all together in all these, they are, tw they are adding up to 25. Find the value of x. So all the numbers we add should give us 25. That's what it means. <laughs> so we are saying 6 plus 5 minus x plus 7 plus 4 minus x plus x plus 3 minus x plus 2. This should give us 25. Now you'll be able to tell that this is negative, that's positive, they'll cancel. And this is negative, and that's negative, so they're going to add, so we're going to have negative 2x there. 6 plus 5, so you're going to get that, you're going to get 11, plus 4 there, get another 11, then you have 3, and the 2 there, get 5 equal to 25 negative 2x this is 22 22 plus 5 27 so you have 25 minus 27 2x when subtract here you get negative 2 you divide both sides this will give you x as one because negative and negative will cancel so we know what x is now then two a math and chemistry only math and chemistry only so math and chemistry only we are talking about this part only now there we have five minus x so this will be five minus one equal to four students don't forget students one course only. One course only can be chemistry or mathematics, chemistry or physics. That would be 6 plus 2, 7 plus 2, 9, that will give you 15 students. So when they say one course only, one subject only, they mean this part, that part, that part alone. See, chemistry and physics but not mathematics. So now they are saying chemistry, chemistry and physics. So chemistry and physics, but not mathematics. So we are removing mathematics. So we are only picking chemistry and physics, which is 7 plus 2 plus 3 minus x. This will be 9 plus 3 minus 1. This will be 9 plus 2. This will give us 11 students. And we end there.